Next, I just want to go over the uh, script editor if, uh, if you're looking for that functionality uh, coming from Maya. So uh, let's just go down and click on this little button right here and it will bring up the script editor. Um, you have several uh, options available in the preferences. So if we go to preferences here, let's just take a look. Uh, we can change the font, font size. We can show line numbers if we want. We can show, uh, you know, white space. Um, you can also change the script language from uh, vScript or JScript. VBScript. I, I uh, generally use uh, JScript uh, when making scripts, so uh, I usually have it set to that. And uh, so let's just create like a really very basic script. Uh, so let's just do a log message. Uh, you know, hello world here. All right, and uh, so we can uh, run this script by pressing the run button, and you'll see uh, it prints out uh, hello world. So um, let's say we have written a script and we want to make a, a button out of it. We can just simply uh, highlight the the uh, script here with the left mouse button and, and just drag and drop into the script uh, tab right here. And uh, it will bring up an add script command uh, dialog. So I'm just going to call this uh, hello world. And then uh, call this hello world as well and uh, we can give it a description and then what it does is it saves out this uh, this script in a, in a file location here uh, you can change that if you want uh, so when I'm finished you hit OK and so now I have this hello world button so whenever I click it it will call that script that has been saved to a particular folder uh, on the uh, on your in your directory structure, so uh, you can also hit, you know Control S to save your script if you want. If you make any changes, uh, and then you have different options such as undo and you find and replace and so forth. You can also clear your history log if you want to clear your script editor. So uh, that's just kind of a, in a nutshell um, uh, how you would uh, kind of use a script editor. And also you can like if you have a command, let's say log message, and you want to find out about that particular. Uh, command that you're using, if you just highlight the, the word and you press the question mark, uh, it will bring up the uh, online documentation that is associated with that, uh, with that uh, command. So um, right now it's kind of loading it right here and then it shows me log message. So um, that's just kind of a, uh, you know, a useful tool when you're trying to figure out uh, how to write your scripts. So uh, uh, yes, yeah, so that's the, uh, the script editor within XSI.